It's cornucopia. <laughs> I don't know how he does. Yes. 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 Maybe we'll get the great zucchini in the water. Who knows? Okay. We. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? It's surprise. So today uh, we are doing the mid solar flare deck, but this time we are all in on the pair paradise and the molecule. Now you may have seen mid solar flare before, one of the better uh, decks in this game period, definitely for solar flare. Uh, the idea of this deck is that you're able to just stall a little bit the first couple of turns and all of your cards end up being very good in the late game. Now, one of the keys to this deck uh, is the reincarnation. This is going to, you know, block that cheese cutter, a really key card. Let's say that the zombies play, uh, you know, let's say even a con man, you can play this in front of it. They'll have to deal with it or it'll even trade eventually. <laughs> um, but this will turn into really overpowered cards, especially on later turns. You're going to have more opportunities to play this uh, because really almost any card in the game, unless it's like water chestnut, if you add one one to it, it's completely OP. Now, um, the idea, so if they play, you're going to play. If they pass, you just pass. And mid means that you're really uh, stalling for just the first few turns, and your tempo really starts turns 3, 4, 5. Uh, so the way you're going to do that is if they swarmed, you're able to catch up with catching mechanics, so heal. Uh, big guy in the field. You're really trying to set up, though, your Paradise or your... Uh, imitators. Uh, the, those are going to be able to copy one of your big cards. So you're really just going to be playing this when it's safe. Usually this will not die to four damage. Uh, you can very easily get, you know, two. Let's say if you play that on turn four, you can get two Allosauruses on two five, which is ridiculously good. Um, any of these cards are good to imitate. We're really going all in instead of being four imitators, we're doing four pair paradise. Uh, and that is going to be a perfect setup for turn 5. It also will be a perfect setup for Molecale. So anytime you have any of these big guys on the field, Molecaling them is going to be a good idea. Um, you, and any just average 6-7 cost plants are just going to be amazing. There aren't that many of them, and they're all pretty much all very good. Um, and Molecale into Pair Paradise, of course, is going to mean that you're going to leap everything and then change, transform everything again, including the Molecale, the first Molecale into five cost cards. You'll be turning your cards uh, into these, the five costs will turn into seven costs, the six will turn into an eight. Uh, if you use a Molecale on a Kernel Corn, it always turns into the Great Zucchini, which is going to turn all their guys into little one ones. Uh, so that's a combo we're looking for. You can even just, you know, copy with your imitator, just copy a catch-up mechanic. You know, if they have three guys in the field, Three cost four four heal your face for three is just amazing. Uh, for the cop cannon, you can just play it dry, but otherwise we do have the little Colonel Pulse, which is a team up. This will also be very good at controlling those early game. You know, things are going to be really problematic as like a teacher or a paparazzi, something small that's going to grow quickly. You definitely don't want to get aggroed in this deck, but that'll actually set up the cop cannon as well in order to get the ability of being able having some removal. Uh, let's see how this deck does. Hope you guys enjoy. Let's get into the game. It should be a very, very fun stream, and I think this deck is going to be very effective, too. I mean, every time we do mid-flare in the stream, it does extremely well. This is a little bit more of a meme version with the Pair Paradise. Again, very expensive environment, easy to remove, but we'll see how it goes. If you think this deck will go 8-2, and two, vote yeah, 7-3, and three or fewer wins, vote no. Voting, of course, is at the live stream, twitch.tv forward slash fryemup. Uh, so we have our early game, and we have a 5. This is exactly what we want to see. Really, a reincarnation, a catch-up mechanic. You know, you don't need that much early game with Solar Flare since the, the superpowers, the weed whack, the super, it just makes it more likely. You never play this on turn one dry, unless, the, you know, if you play Cheese Cutter, I would, I would definitely play it. Can I predict? Can I predict? I don't think I can predict. Streamers can't cast a prediction on their own channel. Come on, man. All right, well, we have 76% voting yes. This is a very strong card. Should I play this and just try to absorb the Rolling Stone that will that will probably hit this Imitator? And if he can't deal with this, I mean, this is really strong. I'll take a 2-6 Bullseye. I'll take a 1-5 Bullseye. If you have a really good opportun opportunity in the first few turns to play your Reincarnation, just do it. That's some resources that didn't answer this, and that's just a whole card out of his hand. We still have, again, a bullseye threat on the field. Uh, we pass. None of these cards are really playable. <laughs> so he moves out of the environment. Thank you! Okay, good. So we win this trade. La-dee-da-dee-da. -dee -da. 
And now this environment just died. It died a, a dirty terrible. It prevented one bullseye damage to his face, though, so there's that. Uh, so it's almost always going to be the setup with Imitator here. There's Stomp it on. Can we deal with this? So this turns into... I don't think this grow. I think this dies instantly. That's very sad indeed. Very sad indeed. I don't think you can play this into the environment. Otherwise, this would be a 3-3, go down to a 2-2, and kill the Stompadon. The Stompadon's a huge problem. A huge problem. Uh, in the meantime, might as well prevent the day. What do we do with this Weed Whack? We're not... Well... Should I Weed Whack this? This always goes in here. It might as well. We don't want to ping him for one. So this always happens. It goes down to 3 health. The question is, what do we do with the Weed Whack? I think we'll save it, since we're kind of winning trades here. So we do get two Astrocados. And again, this Astrocado will do four damage, so... I mean, maybe I should have Weed Whacked this in case he busts it? I don't know. The Stompadon's a problem. Humongous problem. Gosh, here he goes. Who's that? Um, so we'll take the two good traits. <laughs> if he can't answer lane... Oh, he didn't have another card. See, that's huge. So Stompadon got two shots. He's gonna have a little bit of a scary hand, but... I mean, this is doable now. We're also doing all this damage to his face down at 10. We still at 20. Nice this is on heights, because we can protect it pretty well with this, uh, kernels. <laughs> Gotta start using them. It actually kills the 3-1, which is nice. Nice. It's probably gonna be 1 and 5. Other option is 3 and 3. We could go 5 and 1. It, if he, like, commits really, really hard, I'll probably just... I'll probably just go for the double. The double Astrocado again. Little bam bam you get. How you doing? So he commits very hard. Bam big. <sighs> well, well, we can do this next turn. The heal. It's gonna need it. Uh, the thing we really would like to see here is a cob cannon, just to be able to deal with this. I don't think it's going fast enough anyway. I'll probably just put the weed whack on this just to prevent some stuff. We also do have healing. Oh my gosh, look at the molecule. Okay. This is actually way more annoying than it looks. Go! Um... I don't think there's a point in molecaling here. Sorry, guys. The play is simple. It's a you. Ayo. Ayo. Just keep this alive for one more turn. Just makes... I mean, how does he deal with these... Just this turn, how does he deal with Astrocod? None of his superpowers take one out. It's going viral. It doesn't help at all. Um, he could galvanize. It'll be 9 damage. No, it's guaranteed. He actually rolled a 1. But even if he blocks, none of his... He already used his heal. And his smash doesn't kill 5 attack guys, so... Easy. Just Astrocado for days until he dies. Heck yeah. <sighs> I feel like if that game would have been a gimme, I would have BM'd and played the Molokal, but we needed the strike through. 
<laughs> Don't worry, guys. We'll get some molecules in today. Don't even worry about it. Yeah, this is a fine hand against Infinity. You usually gotta get early game in order to be able to deal with him. Okay. Okay. Um, which one of these do I use? Look at the aggression. I think we're just gonna take the extra center. He's clearly playing aggro, so... Probably need to utilize our brains to control him. Or son, I mean. <sighs> Bungie, smoke bomb. Let's make him use the smoke bomb. We could just blast that, though. I think this is better. The, the double, um... It's almost always smoke bomb here, right? Clones, okay. Uh, so these guys are going to be healing for three, probably four. <laughs> this is going to be... Oh no, he's damaging me. What am I going to do? Why didn't he play that on turn one? Why did he play Dry Mini Ninja on turn one instead of Infinity Clones? Against Solar Flare. This man is smart. That's why. That is why. All right. Bye, field. Remember that guy who had a field? Remember the time he had? Remember the time that he did damage to my face? Remember that? Yeah, neither do I. Yeah. <laughs> All right, he's gonna steal block meter. So his pinging my face did accomplish something. That's the good news. And he's smoking that one. Smoking it over. All right, he's got two cards left. I have 17 health and a field. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Line dancing zombie. He actually kind of loses the trade in lane one. Trades with us. We still have 17 health. We can top deck most cards in our deck and get well not most, but we can top we can we can get some. Some imitate trois value here. There's a block, okay, we have another control card. La di da. God damn it. Alright guys, we're all in. <laughs> As we thought we'd be Whoa! He's smoke bombing it? He's bunging. That was beautiful. I wonder if this deck was inspired by the terrible, huge, giganticus deck that I did yesterday. That if you're watching this on YouTube, you will not see. What is this garbage? Is that a surprise garg? I don't even know what's going on. This is not good. Where's all of our cards here, bro? Goodbye. Do we have to just do this? I suppose so. It's probably a surprise garg. But anyway. Alright, we got a lot of sunflower seeds now. This is beautiful. It's not a surprise garg. What a non surprise. Deadly for a card? Don't do anything else. Uh, that goes behind for some reason. Why does that go behind? No! Okay. Well, we can do something now. That's the good news. This is such a bad molecule. The <laughs> worst molecule ever. Alright, go molecule! I should have played this to get a free 2-drop, actually. Aha! Go happen. Yeah, I definitely should have played that, right? Okay. Does he have another bungee plumber? Uh, okay. God damn, this guy could win the game. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I take it back. Oh no. <laughs> okay, bungee plumber. Well, no, it doesn't really win. We're playing this no matter what, right? Most awkward game of PvZ heroes ever. Yep, we are playing this all. 
Uh, this always goes here. This always goes here. This thing is five attack. So three, four, five, six does not win. What could this be? A pogo? Aha, we'll play around pogo. It's line dancing and he wins! I mean, we, we have enough late game in this deck. We just didn't get it. We just didn't get it. He wins. Unbelievable. That was the guy who played Mini Ninja on turn one. How? Wow. You know, if I would have played that Colonel Pulse last turn, I, I would have won that game. Just to get the two drop and to team up in front of that guy. Can't believe it. Reincarnation could have gone a lot better there. Come on, man. Probably need a little bit more. Uh, yes. Come on, grave robber. Come on, teacher. <laughs> yes. Bye, teacher. Welcome, MG Tsuyu. It's 5 a.m. and you pulled an all-nighter to watch the stream? Jeez, that's some commitment. 5 a.m. Where are you from, China? China. Carl. So sweet. Um... Doesn't really matter, right? <laughs> Guys, newspaper. It's ramped to newspaper. What a play. What do we double up on here? Oh my gosh, these molecules look cool. I mean, we're gonna out tempo him, so the only thing. We don't have to be aggressive, so we're gonna go with this. We're definitely win the tempo game. The question is, it does he does he do enough damage before we establish this really kind of slowish field? Um, and that's why you put heals on. We're also blocking. Oh, we're gonna heal so much here. La di da, more heals. <laughs> each each time we draw a card, it, it heals us for two. We're still at eighteen. <laughs> There's like nothing to worry about. We. I feel like the cop cannon might be more useful like this. I think it's gonna be like you. Yeah. I mean, we could just cop here. I don't think so. It's like this. Um, play around going viral, so we'll do it like that. Heck yeah. He could, like... I don't know. Is it going viral? Like a like a hearty treat, but this would do like a million damage here. We kind of played into it too. If he has a hearty treat, we kind of like we we like lose on the spot because this will do three plus eight, eleven, seventeen. Uh, we almost lose. <laughs> ah, okay. That's fine. It could be worse. Damn, man. That's a lot of damage. Oh, we also heal for... See, we take damage, but we also heal two times? <laughs> the synergy! It's so good! Okay... The cow can. 
<sighs> oh, this is a team up. <laughs> it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's just dry cob here now. He'd have to again. He didn't have the hardy treat last. Definitely don't play this. He he didn't have the hardy treat last turn, so he's probably not gonna have it here. He'd have to buff this twice. A go on going viral isn't enough to push this through. He has sugary though, so it even trades with going v double sugary. Okay. So now Weed Whack would bring this down and Scorch would bring it down. That's both of our superpowers, right? If you didn't think that through. We used our super. He, I mean, he doesn't know that we have this in hand, but most of the time that was a complete waste of cards that he really needed to win. So, Here's some more heals. Much needed heals. I wish we would get a safe point that we can just maul again. <laughs> it would be nice. Whee. Mug. All right. Wow. So he gets two superpowers here usually. Newspaper's still in one. Mug's still in two. And Quasar's in three. It's the non-mixed up Grave Digger. Flag in four. He doesn't have Frenzy anymore. And he can't play Frenzy. So again, Mug dies in... No. Mug is in two. Mug is in two. We're cheating. Newspaper. Mug. How about just Molokale, Molokale? And then we can do these next turn. And then we'll put the, the heavier one against the mug. Sounds good to me. Alright, Molokale. Brainana, that's nice. <laughs> nice superpowers, bro. <laughs> nice superpowers. Um, yeah, that that's pretty damn good. This dies for free. You know what we do? This is the play. Uh, because we cheated and looked at his gravestones, we know that we're actually getting uh, two two Astrocados next turn. <laughs> and we know that this is safe. <laughs> this is complete cheating! No, this is complete cheating. It's not fair. We know that the Mug dies too. I mean, this will go, go get some attack, but I don't care. This dies, which we want, because we really want a mulligan. <laughs> Bye, field! <laughs> See ya! <laughs> so this transforms. We just take a nap, we get two more five. Oh, look! Look what I... <laughs> okay, that was not fair. That was not fair. I'm a terrible person. I am such a terrible person. Listen, I don't think... I, listen, I, I think that does fall in the category. There's no way that was intended. You know what I mean? But... Anyone I play, I play a lot of mix up Grave Digger, and anyone I play against can do that. So that's why I don't feel bad doing. I got into a habit of that during the tournament. I asked the tournament mods from the Pantheon tournament, "Am I allowed to use the mug glitch? Is that against the rules?" They're like, "No, listen, everyone can do it. It's not like mix up Grave Digger needs to be any better, too. You know what I mean?" But um, so just since then, whenever I see a mug, I just instinctively click on it and start scrolling. <laughs> Uh, yeah, man. Oh, thank you to 048754. He's the one who actually ended... He did end up donating $30 for those molecules they added to the deck. But, um, the idea is to go all in on that concept, so thank you for reminding me that we have to do that. This is weird. Two imitators is a lot. Two ketchups is a lot. I think that's good enough. It's nice to have an answer to teacher. Jeez. Is it nice? These are scary. I'm so happy PV Zeros does not have emotes. I remember there probably was a point where I would like wish they did, but I find emotes to be so freaking toxic. You know Brawl Stars has emotes? I know that's like years old, but back in the day when I played it, it did not. That's a really freaking that's a four five. That's crazy, man. Like, wow. Look at these reincarnations with the value. I'll take the 4 or 5. That's crazy, man. Should I just go face with that? I think the ketchup mechanics become so good later. I don't even need to. Screw it. 
I'll take the, the, the block meter charge and then we heal it all back anyway. Uh, reincarnation turned into a one cost 3 3. That's a pretty good card right there. Yeah, that's getting scorched. Believe me, guys. <laughs> we Yeah, always scorched. After. We See ya. Rocket? No! No! Okay. God damn it. Uh, yes. Because we want this one to die. Cause it's a 2-2. Two -two. Uh. It's about as good a puff shrooms as you get. It's a 6 drop. There's not really anything we can do about this, huh? I guess if he goes over commits here... And he plays like 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 all star zombie. We could probably get this. Brains. That's the opposite of overcommitting. Astrakado we could play, but he usually just dies. I'm gonna go with this play. It's gonna be like a yo. Why don't we just berry blast this one? See him. Playing going viral and stuff is all scary. I'm probably setting this up is better though, right? Well, yeah, I think we just do this. This is pretty scary. Maybe this should have gone here. Heal. So far, so good. No going viral. No going viral. Oh, we're fine. We're kind of good for the rest of the game now. No, this doesn't do anything. This is not Agro Solar Flare. What the hell? <laughs> you look at this deck and you think it's Agro Solar Flare. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, which one of these do we prefer? We you don't. Know, probably just the aggression, right? We have to kill this guy already. We think protecting a four or five. This is very blastable next turn. Pretty good one cost card. Keep a four or five on the field. Basically, spawn a four or five next turn for one cost. Pretty good card. Celsius. I think we're good here. Chop is active, barely. Took out this one for some reason. I just think the earlier strike through minion is usually better. But what do I know? God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> oh, that sucked. Um set up the cheese for next turn? I think so. Oh, uh, this hurts. It do hurt, though. Is this game pay to win? Maybe. Heals! What is he ramping to? Reincarnation has been garbage. I don't know what's going on. Complete garbage. Bruh. Hey, it's a team up. Oh, never mind. Reincarnation, you're the best card. Reincarnation, best card ever. I've ever seen. Is he going for Bad Moon Rising? Okay, we're going to have to clean, clear his field here. Um, so the play is going to be 1 6 1. I suppose it goes here, right? One, six, best reincarnation ever. Kill an entire minion for one card. That's a great reincarnation. We and one. Let's see if we get Zombot. He kind of needs it right now. We're, we're getting Bad Moon Rising here. I'm just accepting. No, we're not. It's just running, just playing Nebula for like. He's not gonna spend eight brains. I don't know what's going on.
Like, you can make a budget Infinity Pirate deck or a budget Aggro Solar Flare, or if you're good, a budget Midrose and hit Ultimate League every season easily. So, is it pay to win, per se? No. Do you have a very significant advantage if you either pay or grind this game for, like, to get a whole card collection? I mean, doing your quest for, like, two, three years? I've never done the math. Yes. Heck yes. It's 5 a.m. in Australia right now. Cool. All right. We take those. Beating up on a Ring 27 sports deck with no going virals. I feel bad. Not really. Mod to win. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Listen, guys, I, I don't condone modding the game, but if you're going to, at least run fair decks. Don't run 30 Admiral Navy Beans. That's just stupid. I actually beat a guy playing 40 Admiral Navy Beans today. <laughs> Idiot. What the heck is this? What do you... Th what do you think this is? Alright, I'm doing this not because I... 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 I I'm afraid of ghosts or anything like that. I just really want to play this pair next turn. He's gonna replay it in the water, watch. Just dry. Yes! I thank you, my kind sir, for being so generous as to committing all three of your brains. That was very nice. Have a nice day. And also block meter charge. Let's go. La -dee -da -da. This is always happening. <laughs> double Astrica. This is turn four, by the way. We get double Allosaurus. No! <laughs> that guy's <is> trash, bro. <laughs> trash. <laughs> Why? Come on, man. Oh, yeah? No, I'll take a kiss. I'm the freaking leaveable. It's <laughs> so annoying. You know what I do to annoying people? I kill them right in the face. Should I do this? I guess. Maybe I should have saved that, though. Maybe I should have astrocadoed here and then done this. Duh. And then save this combo for when he plays, you know, I don't know what. Octo Zombie or whatever. He plays Octo Mom. Still doing five damage. Very good. Yeah, that was stupid. This is the game I really want Molokel. Like, so badly. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta save for that. Alright, he's controlling us with Bomb Amp. He's using a 3 cost card to remove a, 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 a 6 cost card. That's crazy, man. Dapper, jeez. We're getting owned by this guy. By bombing. That's a good counter to this deck. Explode again. This guy is taking damage, but it doesn't matter. Where's Molokale? Where's Molokale? This is the real question. It's probably just these two now. I guess if he doesn't play enough, we just give him these three. Unos, dos, tres. Okay. Okay. Die! You got the back one for some reason. Thank <laughs> you. 
We where is Molokel? Where is Molokel? <laughs> Can you do more merch, please? Yeah, it's it's coming up. I'm working on I actually have someone who's managing my merch now, so we are going to be creating that hopefully in the next week. We're going to have a lot of different merchies. Please send links through uh, channel points only. Thank you. Thank you. Should I keep this or should I look for a good hand? Sorry, guys. Okay, that's better. Talking about Raven niches. What? Forehead merch? How about just a picture from like here to here? How about like a a hat that you put on, like a beanie, and it just makes your hair look like my hairline? That's a good idea. We should print my hairline onto a beanie. And just on the back it'll say bald him up. Such a good idea, guys. You guys are geniuses. What did the pirate say when it turned 80 years old? It said... It said, uh... God damn it. Are I gonna... Are, I'm, are am I gonna die? Fuck, that didn't work. <laughs> Didn't work. Uh, I take double reincarnations every time. They're twice as good. We're gonna get some some crazy stuff this game. This is my favorite card. Come on, let's go. No, he said. Uh, he said. Um, I don't know. Eighty years old. Okay. That didn't work. Ooh, we have a good thing. We have a thing. Do I weed whack this no matter what? Like, what if we get a... I mean, the chance of getting a card that answers that is very small. <laughs> Stomp it on? Stomp it on? Are you human? Nope. Absolutely not. Is this scary enough to gamble on? I could just play this one. It's a fitty fitty. Do you go for the fitty fitty? It's a two out of three chance. And I can always play that one next turn. Alright, let's go for it. Survey says. That's fine. Plus a 5-2 is good enough to play here. You can't really do anything about it either. That's that's okay. It killed the Galvanize. It killed the Flag Zombie and the Galvanize roll. One card. You take those. That is cool. I probably will play this now. 
Coach. Coach Boyard D. So it's always like this and like that. Gotta get the order correct there. Yeah, not a lot of Rolling Stones today. Been, been dodging those. Matrix style. Molecule looks cool. It's always gonna be this though. This 3 3 is pretty, pretty good. Double Allosaurus on turn 5. It's a classic. He is protected. We're in decent shape. This, um. We're actually double healing. See, besides for healing your face against aggro, the amount of tempo this gives by healing just themselves, like this is going to go up to 4-6, 4-5, it just brings these out of range of uh, the opponent having any shot at trading a minion against them. So what do we do here? We can berry blast into pair, we can just draw a cob cannon... The, the good news is there's no sense of urgency. I think this dying would be sad. Should we Berry Blast in Molecule since we haven't really had a... How about Berry Blast into Pear? Okay. Then we'll get a double Molecule next turn. Sounds good to me. We're not, like, low in health or anything, so... Oh, he's pretty... Okay. This one dies for free. Yeah. The Cobb Cannon would have been exceedingly sad there. Excessively sad. So if we get a three, that would be nice. Rawr. This is a this turns into a three. Do we go for the I don't know. I mean it gives us a seven drop and a five drop. We could also just commit this and I don't know. Maybe just double cow cannon is correct here. I don't know guys. <laughs> Bro. I think this is a really safe molecule for next turn, so this will be fine. This is a really good play. We'll, we'll get a better molecule next turn. That's all I'm trying to say. It just negates a lot of the damage coming in. It's all very safe. We also win if we block and get super. Got him. <laughs> See ya. Oh, I probably shouldn't be in there, right? We're far enough ahead of this game. <laughs> Oh, well. <laughs> no opportunities. You know, this deck is too good for Molecule. It doesn't need it. I should have BM'd there, though. I should have totally BM'd there. <laughs> I feel bad. I'm having instant regrets. Why did I... Why did I win that game, man? Right, that was unnecessary. Fine hand indeed. No, 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 no. Bro, don't be trash. Do I even do this? Or since I have this one, I want it to stay alive. Well, yeah, this is fine. I should have done the BM play. I don't know why I'm being such a sweaty guy today. Aha! What the bra is that? What the bra is that? <sighs> Did I just keep him off the field? I think I do. I, I really, I, I don't want to just get it behind because of pirates. It's not worth it. Now we can only play one card next turn, and he's a sad boy. I'll we'll just pass this turn. He can't, he can't gain enough momentum this turn. Enough. 
So if he goes graves, I go like this. If he goes dry, we're going with the ketchup. Good enough. Bungie, bungie. A lot of resources. It's kind of getting scary though. These lanes being clogged, I think it's nice. Let's go like that. <laughs> okay. Just gonna ride these two cards all the way to the promised land. Too bad dude. he doesn't die to fairy blast anymore. Ugh. The bullseye is killing us here. It's a three. How do we do this? Just really have to stall for the kernel, right? I could go with these two. I just, what if this is a flame face, though? Very sad indeed. Should probably keep playing around removal though, right? Yes. Pretty good monkey though. It just means these guys can't hit us. This also dies to berry blast. It's really just all about getting the kernel in, in at this point. We also have two huge minions now running these guys. Okay, so we have to kill this if it's a... Yeah, we don't really have much of a choice here. If it's a flame face, it has to die. It has to die. So it's gonna be like you, and then process of elimination. We actually win also, if he doesn't have an answer to one of these. Guys, don't you think um, process of elimination would be a very good, like, assassin movie title? So he's doing 5-2, we win, I mean, if he Cali rolls... Well, no, he doesn't even do the 2 anymore. There we go. <laughs> pirates, guys! Able to keep pirates off the board. Jeez, that was tough. I mean, that guy... Is... He could, if he would have gotten the flame face a few turns earlier, we would not have... <laughs> we would not have won that game. But on the other hand, if he had that, then he probably would not have had the fruit cake or something else. Or the swash, or just one of the one of the pirates. No leaps. I don't know the no bitches meme, but maybe I'll, I'll probably in my Discord make like a merch. Once I get the merch going, I'll make like merch ideas. We'll we'll, we'll have something. Maybe we'll even make a channel points where you can suggest one. It'll be for like. 5,000 channel points, whatever. You like Tim Horton? It's okay. Not my most favorite thing on the planet, but... I'm not really a coffee shop guy. Unless it's like for a date, you go to a, you know, first date, you go to a coffee shop. But like, I just make my instant... Ness, whatever it's called. Taster's Choice. Instant coffee at home, I'm very happy. I look like Mega Mind, huh? <sighs> Control Boogs. Let's see if he has an environment. None of his environments are proactive, so playing this is pretty safe. They're all just gonna be defensive. 
He's probably just going for piano anyway. And if he doesn't answer that, he can't answer to to Allosaurus's next turn. No bitches is Mega Mind asking if you don't. <laughs> Guys, it's the control foot soldier zombie deck. Don't mess. Podcasts, not anytime soon. I'm doing roasts instead. Someday I'll do podcasts again. Dry cob ain't bad here. It's probably stupid though, right? It's probably just like this. Locust Swarm? At least he killed the team up one, that was smart. Come on, Molecule! This is the- he has- Okay, guys. I, you waited a long time. <laughs> this is definitely gonna be the Molecule. This one also doubles up. It's kinda cool how he killed it. Okay, so we're playing... Should I play this one, too? We'll give him one of these. What do we kill here? Give him that. And, uh, do we berry blast something? Maybe we'll berry blast something. All right, let's let's go. We okay, finally. <laughs> That's nice. Conjure. Just one active ability. So more team ups for uh, Kyle Cannon. Oh, okay. That's nice. We actually conjure two things now. We definitely take those. La di da di da. Okay, five potatoes. Time to get some soul patches. <laughs> yep. No. Is he real? Okay, 3 Nut sucks. 3 Nut, you're garbage. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, 3 Nut, you're complete trash. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Alright, we're definitely sacrificing 3 Nut. We don't like 3 Nuts at all. Die, 3 Nut. Purposefully making 3 Nut die. 3 Nut, you're complete trash. No one likes you. End the story. Uh, he usually dies anyway. No. As if this nightmare wasn't gonna get any worse. Oh, it is. Oh, he's going for some deadly. He's going for some. I go play another minion. <laughs> I feel so bad for this guy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna concede that. This is guaranteed lethal, right? We're gonna do this, and if he doesn't concede, I concede here. This is guaranteed. We can call this guaranteed lethal. There's no way out. There's no way out. There's no way out. I'm gonna count this as a win. He's only rank 17. I feel I feel bad. We'll do our we'll give him the star. Three not ruined everything. Oh, we could have rescued Radish Mall Kale. Duh, I forgot. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Why didn't I rescue Mall Kale? <laughs> I totally forgot about that. This is the problem when the chat's on the delay. I miss all the good ideas. Bye, Molecule. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry! I'm sorry, I'm stupid, okay? I'm just stupid. <laughs> of course you rescue Radish Molecule there, Fry. The Colonel Corn was so good, though. It was so juicy. That would have been such good BM, though. Okay, he got newspaper. That's nice. What is this gonna be? Teleportation zombie, rat, squirrel. Two cost three, three. I think we take this. It's Tele Zomba. That newspaper zombie is kind of um, making that first lane a little annoying. Annoying! For real. For real? <sighs> okay. I don't know. I, I'm probably really stupid here, right? <sighs> I 
I kind of needed to do that. The question is, what do we do? I don't really have plays. We're taking five next turn. I don't know what to do here, actually. We need a play or something. The question is, where does it go? This is so bad. Which one of these do we do? this one. This way when this hits us it's gonna get blocked maybe for this one. Uh, okay that's not scary at all. I need any playable card right now and I'll be I'll be fine. I'll just sigh a sigh of relief. Yes! Yes. Yes indeed. This does four? It's a lot. The Scorch and the everything take care of this. Really, all three superpowers kill, like, one of these, if not both, so... Him really hitting us for nine is almost impossible. Alright, that guy may or may not have 13 attack. <laughs> oh, no. oh, no! Scorch would be a really easy use. The other two powers... Okay. I <laughs> just to decide which one to kill, that would have been difficult. Bye. Okay, this is a sl okay. Okay. Boo. All right. I think instead of sacking, this doesn't hunt. It does not hunt. If that hunts, I'm a I'm a goat. What do you think about Mr. Beast? I don't. Know. He's a guy who makes YouTube videos. I don't really have like major judgments on these people. <laughs> Sorry. Wow, so we have the uh the, the really, really good two for one cob cannon. Exceedingly good. Excessive three for one. We take three for ones. We take those in this channel. We definitely take those. Goodbye! <laughs> Didn't really play around cob there, did he? Probably didn't. Hey, only two cards left. Then it plays. All right, now we're safe. Now you're safe. Uh, hunt minions don't really work in that environment, which is the good news. The good news. Okay. What is he gonna do? Alienos? I don't even know what he's gonna do. Oh, what's going on? I think that was the correct lane, but I'm not sure. Correct lane and play. 4 or 5 damage, but it heals us up, heals our class. It's gotta be worth it, right? Okay, there's Molokel. Oh, look at this guy! <laughs> look at this guy! He probably. Oh, I guess killing that is correct. I want to get the Great Zucchini one time today, guys. One time. One time. We're, we're going for the Great... This is the end, guys. We're going for the Great Zucchini. I don't care. The Great Zucchini. This is fine. We haven't done that yet. We gotta do it. Oh, okay, never mind. It's Cornucopia. It's Cornucopia. It's Cornucopia. <laughs> yes. 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 Maybe we'll get the great zucchini in the water. Who knows? Okay. We. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Soul patch, not bad. Mm, pretty good. What do we get? And Cornucopia is trash as usual. As usual, Cornucopia being completely trash. <laughs> okay. Well, that was fun. Oh, that, that that makes the bets, too. We lost that one game, though. Easy. Easy. <sighs> the answer is yes.
Yay. Enjoy your, your bits, guys. 77 voted yes. 70%. Briar Rose decks ever come back? Maybe. We did a couple. You're right, I haven't done a Briar Rose deck in a long time. I'll write it down. Briar Rose deck. Maybe like Ram Package? I don't know. Okay, 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 okay. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing here? That is fine. Time to get hit by the cheese. You haven't seen cheese cutter on one yet. The whole reason we do this. Uh. Uh. I think him playing fossil head and friends next turn is scary enough that we'll control this. I'm respecting middle manager. Now that we've made a few really insane good decks, uh, especially Z-Mech and Rustle with middle manager, I, I just respect it now. Enjoy the bits I wish for. <laughs> yeah, I'll try to really start the stream at a consistent time every day. I'm just... What is he gonna go for? I mean, it's a mustache. Sorry, what did he play on one? Middle manager? Oh, he got this from Milmus. It's not a mustache deck. Uh, I'll, I'll just let this be a two for one. He could Rolling Stone, but still a two for one. There's no, nah. Uh, the Berry Blast is worth more. That's fine. Now we kill. Now we kill. Instead of keeping a 2 1 on the field, we kill a galvanize with these cards. I'll definitely take it. I think the Weed Whack is the better card. Just saving the one cost card that reduces attack and all that. It's usually better than Buried Bless. Because it costs one. Where we're in a situation where we can only play, you know. We want to more efficiently use our sun. Which usually this is on seven, really five, six, seven is the way. Okay. So we could just do nothing. This this does kill it and gets it off the field. I feel like this is gonna be better later. It's not worth it. I could have just weed whacked that though. Like what if he buffs it this next turn or something? You'd have to really reduce this by three health. Very unlikely. Super Neubagar. I knew I was dyslexic when I went to a toga party dressed as a goat. <laughs> Thank you, Cat Lady, for the win. So we win this trade. We're healing back. We're taking some heat here, but we're healing it back. And we're, we're going to be able to deal with this. No big deal. Sandwich. Thank you. I, I actually should have played this here. Because Dry Cop... I wasn't really thinking about the Dry Cop cannon. It doesn't look like it makes a difference anymore. It's still Dry Cop, right? There's no way we can start... I don't know what he's gonna... I mean, uh, 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 it would be really awkward playing this. It's just dry cough. Wins the tree. Then we'll do the the upgraded cough next turn. Jeez. Wow. That's a lot. Oh, that is a lot. The Supernova Guard is so scary if we're gonna play a second cop here. Okay. Dun dun, king of the crown. So what's the the biggest thing he could have here? Like, he would have to get... This would go down to 3 health. We could even make it 2. Is there any way he can break through this? I don't think so. With 1. I mean, it would have to be a... I think this is safe.
There's no way he can add three attack to this card, right? There's no way. No way. Didn't think so. I think we blocked the five. <sighs> Are we gonna double Molokale kill next turn? This is a pretty good scorch. The chances of either... What do we get on turn 8? It's either going to be Heal Your Face for 10, which saves us, or it's going to be Kernel Corn, which means we shouldn't have played the other one, but... I, I, it's it's probably just competitively double Maul and Kalina jokes. That's annoying. Now oh, what did we do? How good is Kernel Corn? We could just develop more things. We kind of need to heal though. Well, healing for 10. Five drops usually. All right, let, let's let's just yeah, sorry. I, I'm I'm just trying to concentrate here. This is a really tough play. So either one is good. I didn't forget about an 8-drop, right? Oh, and Dragon. So Dragon kills the guy here. That's a really good, tough beat, too. Oh, it actually makes an extra. How much does this get? What? No, did the game... S oh, he has, a, he has an ability to use. Okay. Oh, that's rough. I, I think I blew it. Because him throwing a guard that survives... I forgot about Dragon, too. You know, I, I really needed two shots. That's fine. Can we please get... Oh, we actually get saved here. Unbelievable. Unbelievable that we get saved. In fact, Swabby brings us down to one health here. My gosh. My gosh. I, I That was probably a complete blunder, right? We actually have a lot of healing now to do. This dies for free. He can't play really tricks efficiently. Oh, man. We lucked out so badly there. I forgot about Dragon. Okay, so he's done. So we just want to heal as much as possible, right? So these heal for five a, a piece. It's probably not even this one. It's probably just the... This also kills you. So it's going to be seven, eight, nine. Look at this play, guys. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Got heals? <laughs> this also kills the Supernova Guard and prevents 6 damage here, which is crazy. And we'll let the Swabby live. Alright. <laughs> Dodged a huge bullet. He can't play anything. He can play an environment. It would be, uh, it wouldn't do anything either. Dice to six damage. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay! Okay! <laughs> that was intense! That was very intense. That's actually going in the highlight comp. That was crazy. What a way to end the stream. What turn was that on? It was on turn, uh, turn eight. Uh, let me just write that down real quick before we end this. Game ten, turn Nice Gargs bro. Nice Gargs bro is right. He would have got me. He would have, if he would have gone to see Deep Sea Garg, which the chances are he does, he totally would have got me. Now, it happened to be that Rodeo Garg was really, really lucky. But at the end of the day, it pushed it something into the other. I, I really ended up pinging his Garg turn Garg three times by getting the Kernel Corn, which might have been a mistake there. I, I, it's hard for me to read. There wasn't enough time to really 
think of all the odds of all the things that could happen in the turn. <laughs> but I don't know. Hey, we won. That was a pretty good highlight. All right, guys, nine and one, mid, mid kale. I mean, uh, when does this not win at least ninety percent on a stream? I think the first two times we did this went ten and zero. Anyway, uh, that was a very fun version of uh, mid flare. Hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely did. Peace. This is Fry.